Let's go, Kings! Let's go, Kings! Well, here we are at the Orange Bowl after 72 years. It's a lot of wonderful memories here. Uh, great for the community. And uh, I'm, I'm just so emotionally overwrought that, you know, uh, where's my prop? Oh, my. I'm going to cry. Oh, bye-bye. Oh, all right, bye-bye. Edge is the call. Chairman Cypress. Tails it is. Hurricanes are going to toss. Let's go, Kings! Let's go, Kings! Move the ball out to the 20-yard line. Make the motions today, you know, it's farewell, goodbye to the Orange Bowl. Had a lot of memories, a lot of good times here with the Dolphins and the Hurricanes. Um, it was fun to see the guys and be around the old players, but it's also kind of sad saying goodbye to the Orange Bowl. My favorite Orange Bowl memory is a 1983 National Championship game against Nebraska. Well, when, uh, when Nebraska went for the two-point conversion to win, you could hear a pin drop in this stadium. And uh, talking about the 85 Bear game, and what a great memory that was. Where that was the only game the Bears lost that year. And we dominated them. We had 30 some points at halftime. And the fans were just so excited. That the stadium was electric. And uh, it's got to be one of my great memories. The memories I have of this place, rusting up as it is, as busted up as it is, it, it holds a history that is unmasked in sport. The Dolphins' 26 home game winning streak is still on top, and it's always been on top since we did it. You know what, to bring back some of the memories, to see all the people here, kind of one last time is special. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, yeah. I, mean, I played my whole career to get in the Ring of Honor and the Hall of Fame to get my name up on the stadium. I don't, it's a shame we got to knock it down. It's outstanding. You know, everybody came out and supported this the way it did. It's a shame. You know, we're not going to have the Orange Bowl anymore, but a lot of great tradition and, and you know, it's, it's, we move on over time. You know, it's, it's, uh, it's amazing coming here with Hall of Famers like, you know, Larry Little and Dwight Stevenson and Dan Marino and Shula and all those guys and seeing the legends of UM. It, it, was, uh, it was an honor. And so many great players uh, down here today that have come through this Orange Bowl. So many great games and historical moments. And, and to, be, uh, to be a part of that for an hour or two and uh, playing a little Legends game, I think, was a, was a good lot of fun. All good memories. I don't remember any ever losing here. Let's go, Kings! Let's go, Kings! Well, here we are at the Orange Bowl after 72 years. A lot of wonderful memories here, uh, great for the community. And uh, I'm, I'm just so emotionally overwrought that, you know, uh, where's my prop? Oh, my. I'm going to cry. Oh, bye-bye. Oh, all right, bye-bye. Edge is the call. Chairman Cypress. Tails it is. Hurricanes are going to toss. Let's go, Kings! Let's go, Kings! Move the ball out to the 20-yard line. Quarterback. Touchdown. 
Sad saying goodbye to the Orange Bowl. My favorite Orange Bowl memory is a 1983 national championship game against Nebraska. Well, when, uh, when Nebraska went for the two point conversion to win, you could hear a pin drop in this stadium. And uh, talking about the 85 Bear game, and what a great memory that was. Where that was the only game the Bears lost that year. And we dominated them. We had 30 some points at halftime. And the fans were just so excited. Uh, the stadium was uh, electric. And uh, it's got to be one of my great memories. The memories I have of this place rusting up. Mixed emotions today, you know, it's farewell, goodbye to the Orange Bowl. Had a lot of memories, a lot of good times here with the Dolphins and the Hurricanes. Um, it was fun to see the guys and be around the old players, but it's also kind of 